We welcome you to Dentamax 2013, the next major release for the Dentamax practice management software. As in the past, Dentamax 2013 has a theme, and that would be clinical and paperless. And so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take you through the major features that we've added to Dentamax 2013. The first thing that I'd like to show you today is how easy it is to access your digital x-rays from within the charting screen in Dentamax. So let's go ahead and zoom on over to the appointment book. We'll click on scheduler here and I'll right click on Paige Davis's appointment. We'll go down to view chart. And then from here um, you'll note that we changed the screen colors in the charting screen. But you'll also note that I have numbers under each of the teeth. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and click on X-ray images, a new tab here at the bottom. We've got a lot of X-rays for Paige Davis. And I'll click on the four on tooth number 31. When I do that, what that means is there are four X-rays that correspond to tooth number 31. So by clicking on it, I immediately can see the four, four X-rays that correspond to tooth number 31. If I double click on one of those, I'll pull up my phone on imaging software so I can further, further analyze that that x-ray. Um, you can also from within this uh, tab click on dates and view all of your x-rays taken on a specific date. Another neat thing is that you can pull this tab, you can drag it over and move it someplace else. And So you can expand it where you have extra room here on the side. And so as you can see um, our digital, digital feature inside the software for x-rays is tightly integrated where you can view your teeth and do your treatment planning with your digital x-rays at the same time. Dentamax 2013 offers you the ability to quickly and easily enter in clinical notes or progress notes, if you will. Uh, to do this, uh, the first thing you'll want to do is click on the clinical notes tab here. And you can move this off to the side if you want. That way you can view your x-rays and your clinical notes at the same time if you want. Uh, uh, the way I like to enter my clinical notes, I'll go to my clinical notes menu. And I've created an um, icon for each of my clinical notes. And so you can click on your icon. In this case, we have our composite filling. We'll click on our tooth. And then my customized clinical note that I've already created will pop up. Within those clinical notes, you'll have things that change depending on, on your treatment for the patient. And so here we did a composite. It's going to ask me what kind of anesthetic did I use. Okay, that's a variable that might change. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and pick lidocaine. It'll ask me how many carpools I used and so forth. I'll go ahead and enter in my variables and very easily and very quickly I can enter in my clinical note. Okay. If you want, you can lock down these clinical notes right away by clicking on your little lock key right here or within 10 days your note will lock down for you. You can also print these out if you'd like for further review. Another neat new feature in Denimax 2013 is electronic prescription writing. This is the ability to send electronically all classes of drugs as a prescription. Huge, tremendous time saver for you and your staff and for your patients. Let me show you how this works. On the left hand side of your screen from your patient's record, we can click on prescriptions. And instead of pulling up the old paper prescription writing tool, it takes you to our electronic prescription writing web, web page. And then from here, uh, we have Emily Sandia. We'll click on prescribe next to her name. And let's say that Sandia just had some um, had her wisdom teeth extracted. So I can go ahead and prescribe her some Vicodin. Okay. And we'll go ahead and click on find. So we can select the exact form of Vicodin that we wish to prescribe to um, Emily here. And okay, we'll go ahead and prescribe her some 300 mg tablets. And then, for my demo purposes, I've already prescribed this once or twice, and so the program alerts you to that. Hey, this is a duplicate. So this is a wonderful tool for alerting you to those types of things. Um, if uh, there was a drug or an interaction issue or an allergy issue, we'd also find that as well. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and prescribe anyway. And then from here, we can go ahead and fill out the instructions, uh, the details for this prescription. So I'm going to go ahead and we'll do a... Uh, two Vicodin tablets by mouth every um, four hours and we'll say as needed for pain and this will go on for 
let's say seven days. Um, that's quite a lot of Vicodin there, maybe a little too much. See, every four hours. Okay. Well, for our example, our example, we'll keep going here. And uh, we'll allow substitutions. And we'll go ahead and click on continue here at the bottom. And this will allow us to view uh, a sample of our prescription. Now, if, you're, if you are the provider, you can go ahead and OK this right here. If you're not the, the doctor, um, later on, you can go back into the software and uh, you can uh, enter in your, your secret signature password to OK the prescription. Okay? But if you're, if you're prescribing it yourself as a provider, you can go ahead and put your password in here and send it electronically. And so prescription writing electronically doesn't get better than that. A huge, tremendous time saver for both you, your staff, and also your patients. Another neat new feature in Denimax 2013 is online eligibility. This is a huge feature. Unless you've been the one to follow up with the insurance company to collect eligibility status and break down the coverage, um, you might not understand how hard insurance companies are to work with. How about bypass that whole phone conversation thing and download that information real time online within Denimax? Neat new feature here. And so let me show you how this works. You can view uh, the eligibility status for all the patients within a day, week, or month, or individually by patient appointment. So in this case, we're going to go ahead and check out David Arnett's eligibility status for his insurance. So I'm going to highlight his appointment and simply click on for this appointment here on the left-hand side. It says we're waiting for a response. And, and now we have the details that David is eligible. Not only do we have the details, but as we expand this view, we can see that uh, his insurance is good insurance. It covers 100% of diagnostic. Uh, it covers 100% of preventative. And you can scroll down and get this complete breakdown of his insurance real time online. What a huge time saver. The next neat new feature I want to share with you is the ability to send x-rays and other items electronically. Now, why is that a big deal? A lot of dental offices end up sending their high production type procedures, root canals, crowns, bridge work, they end up sending those on paper. Why? Because they don't know how to send that electronically. It's too difficult to do. Well, Denimax 2013 totally streamlines this process so you can send your x-rays and other attachments electronically, meaning that you're going to get paid a lot faster on those claims. Okay? And so let's go ahead. We're going to go to our claims manager. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to um, filter my claims by attachments that are required. And we're going to see right here for David Synergy that he has um, an attachment required for his claim. So we're going to double click on his claim here. And we have a new tab called NEA Fast Attach. We'll go ahead and click on that. And it says that yes, in fact, an attachment was required. So all we need to do is click on Add Attachment here in the bottom right hand corner. And we'll click on continue. So this is being required for our personal fused to metal D2750 code. We'll click on continue. And we'll go ahead and we'll attach a bite wing. We'll click on continue again. And we're going to go ahead and pull this directly from Denimax Imaging. There are other options. We can do a screenshot or pull it directly off the file. In this case, so we're going to take it from our imaging software. We'll click on continue. And here they are. We can go ahead and if we want, just click on the attachment we want to do. Maybe just double click it, puts it right there. We'll click on use, and now we can go ahead and send this electronically to the insurance company, saving us a ton of time uh, in getting paid. Let's review lab tracking, our next clinical paperless feature here in Denimax 2013. Uh, so let's say David Arnett needs to come back in a couple of weeks for his new dentures. And so we'll use our mini calendar here. In the upper left-hand corner of our screen, we'll click on the 24th and make a new appointment for David Arnett. So we'll go ahead and put his name in there, hit enter, and we'll select lab case. And we'll go ahead and we'll click on create a new lab order. Okay, click on yes to save our changes before proceeding. And from here, we can go ahead and type in dentures for our upper arch. And we can say what tooth number it's for. It's actually for our upper arch, so there's not a tooth number. Shades is maybe an A1. And we can go ahead and even select what lab 
we're using. We're using, we're using Great Lab, and it's for our appointment outlet 24. We don't have a receive date yet because we're just uh, ordering these. Uh, we can put our dollar amount for that lab and even a note if we want. Now, before the next appointment, we can work our lab cases to make sure that they're in. So we'll go ahead and we'll go to list and then, then go down to lab order list. And then from here, we can see a complete list of our lab cases. As we receive them, we can double click on them and select the date that we received them on. Let's say we got ours just at the nick of time on the Friday before the 21st and save our changes. And so again, this is a great way to go paperless and track a lot of these things that you're dealing with in your office to make sure that your workflow goes smoothly with your patients. Another paperless feature in Dentamax 2013 is the ability to sign your treatment plans electronically directly from within your charting screen. So let's say we have Paige Davis here as one of our patients and we have a treatment plan. Instead of printing that out into paper and having her sign a piece of paper, we'll go ahead and click on Treatment Estimate here on the side. Okay. When we go into here, we'll click on Sign instead of Print. Okay. Click on Sign and click select the uh, one with the signature. Say OK. And then we'll pull out our little, little Topaz signature pad and have Paige Davis sign it. Paige Davis. Okay. Now the program will allow you to store this seamlessly directly into the, uh, the document center. Here we have our treatment plan with the signature here at the bottom. And it automatically puts the date on there as well, today's uh, current date. Another neat new feature in Dentamax 2013 is the ability to send instant messages to your staff members. We've all been in a practice before where patients are overflowing everywhere, making it extremely difficult to communicate with your staff members. In those cases, you can go ahead and click on in the bottom right hand corner of your screen, your instant messenger icon, um, and this will allow you to send messages to your various computers in your practice. In this case, we'll send a message to ourselves to the uh, computer label David, and then what we'll do is we'll go ahead and type in our message. I'll go ahead and paste mine in here. You can type it in. Our emergency patient just arrived. Muller is sensitive to hot and cold. And if you want to assign a sign to this, we can. And we can even make it private. I'll show you what that does. So we'll click on send. And then, moments later, your instant message will pop up. And in this case, um, I might have patients around me. I don't want them to see. So as soon as I'm by myself, I'll click to view the message that our patient just arrived. His molar is sensitive to hot and cold. And so wonderful feature, making communicating with staff members that much easier. The next paperless feature I want to show you from Dentamax 2013 is the task manager. Uh, you can access that several ways. One of them is just by pressing F12 on your keyboard. This replaces those sticky notes, those little notepads that we all use at the front desk or in the operatories to keep track of what's going on. Uh, this is a great way to clean up your office, clean up your desk. Instead of having to put it on a sticky note, you can stick that little uh, task on your task list. To do that, again, you can press F12, and once this is up, it will remain on your computer screen. You can just stick it here in the bottom right-hand corner if you want and maneuver to other parts of the software, and it remains there. Okay? And so uh, let's go ahead and maybe add a new task. You can right-click with your mouse and click on New Task. And from here, we can say we need to call Blue Cross Blue Shield. We'll tab down to our notes section, and I'll paste in my note. Uh, I wrote, uh, call Sarah at Blue Cross Blue Shield, the phone number, to ask about the new fee schedule. How important is that? Well, not super important, but semi. We'll give that a, a, a priority, priority level of three, and that is due by the end of the week. And we even want to have an alert warning pop up when we go into the program tomorrow. Maybe we want to be reminded about that. Click on Save Changes, and then we can go into here and look at our own task list that we have, or other people's, other staff members maybe, if we're the manager, and then go through them. Uh, so in this case, maybe we uh, want to go ahead and talk, give Mindy a, a phone call. We can do that, and when we're done, we'll go ahead and say Complete as of today, and Save, and it will take it off our list. Wonderful way of decluttering your desk, allowing you to put all those sticky notes instead of on your desk into the software 
where the software can now be proactive to remind you of those important things.